वेलकम फ्रेंड्स टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल ट्रिक टू लर्न फार्माकोलॉजिकल क्लासिफिकेशन टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द एडिनर्जिक ड्रग्स एंड इट्स क्लासिफिकेशन सो फ्रेंड वी स्टार्ट द क्लासिफिकेशन विद द कैटेगरीज ऑफ द ड्रग्स एज यू कैन सी द कैटेगरीज लाइक फर्स्ट वन इज सी एन एस स्टूमेंट सेकेंड वन इज प्रेशर एजेंट थर्ड वन इज नेजल डी कॉन्सिस्टेंट नेक्स्ट कैटेगरी इज कार्डियक स्टूमेंट नेक्स्ट वन इज ब्रोंको डायलीटर्स नेक्स्ट एनोरेक्टिक्स एंड लास्ट वन इज यूटोराइन रिलैक्सेंट ओके सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टू मेमोराइज दीज कैटेगरीज दैन वी गो फॉर द ड्रग्स बिलोंग्स दिस कैटेगरी ओके सो फॉर मेमोराइजिंग दिस कैटेगरी आई हैव ऑलरेडी uh drawn a diagram by which we can easily understand and memorize the category of the drugs so this is uh, this one is a diagram here you can see on the first number there is a brain which is a part of the cns okay i correlate this brain with the cns because the brain is a part of the cns so the first number is brain second there is a pressure agent third one is here is nose so the term is nasal fourth one is heart i use the term here cardiac okay fifth one is bronchi sixth one is stomach okay and i correlate it with the term anorectics anorectics these are the agent which cause the loss of appetite okay and last one is the seventh that is uterus okay so step by step uh, we can memorize these terms and by which we can memorize the categories of this diagram okay so now move towards the drugs their categories and the tricks used for memorizing these drugs okay so i start with first one is cns stimulant here i use the term mad med okay m stand for methamphetamine a for amphetamine and d for dex amphetamine right second one is pressure agent in the pressure agent we can see uh, matthew may take phenyl in den okay matthew may takes phenyl in den matthew Matthew stand for methoxamine, me that is mefentermine, phenyl, okay, phenyl for the phenylephrine, and den, D E N, D stand for dopamine, E for ephedrine, and N for noradrenaline. Now move toward the next category, that is nasal D consistent. Here I use the trick like Nafis gives pseudo phenyl, okay. Here is a phenyl square, two ox. Okay, nafis is a name, and I correlate this term with the drug nafazuline. Okay, nafis that is nafazuline, pseudo, pseudo ephedrine, phenyl. There are the two terms, phenylephrine and phenylpropanolamine. Next one is ox, oxymetazuline, and this X is xylometazuline. Okay. next category is cns stimulant okay in the sorry cardiac stimulant is now cns stimulant in the cardiac stimulant i root here adrena heart is in doubtful condition okay adrena's heart is in doubtful condition it is a name adrena heart is in doubtful condition heart correlate with this cardiac adrena that is adrenaline is that is isoprenaline doubt that is dobutamine okay next category is bronchodilator here i use the trick that is cisfet okay you can memorize in the group sis and fet s for solbutamol i for isoprenaline next as for solmeterol 
F that is formiterol A4 adrenaline and T4 terbutaline. Next category is anorectics. For the anorectics, I use Cebu's fins sit on decks. Okay, Cebu is the name. So Cebu's fin are friends. Okay, Cebu's friends sits on decks. Right, Cebu that is sibutramine. Fen is fenfluramine. Dex is dex fenfluramine. Okay. Next category is uterine relaxant. And for that, I use the trick. Ritu, it is a name. Ritu is supreme celebrities. Okay. Ritu is supreme celebrities. Ritu that is ritodrine is supreme that is iso supreme celebrities celeb okay here the pronunciation is celeb that is solbutamol and last one is ties t's that is t for terbutaline so friends with the help of these tricks you can easily memorize the category of the drugs and the name of the drugs okay so if you like these tricks so please share and like the video and subscribe the video thank you